If the valve needs to be replaced, which most of the time we don't need to do, then there are a couple of uh, different options here. There are uh, mechanical valves, these uh, valves that are made of metal. Uh, they just have two little flaps that uh, open and close as the blood passes through it. And these are good because they last a long time. They can last a lifetime. But the problem with this is that you must take a blood thinner with it. And uh, although older people usually are okay with taking the blood thinner, most of the young people don't want to take a blood thinner. And it also requires a blood test once a month to monitor the level of blood thinning. The other types of valves, as I mentioned, are pig valves, cow valves, or human valves. These valves don't require any medicines. That's the good news. Uh, the bad news is that they don't last as long as we would like, and they, uh, they wear out uh, because they are tissues, and they, the tissues can't really, uh, at least these tissues can't repair themselves and, and revitalize. So they wear out, and how long they last depends a little bit on the age of the patient. But unfortunately, the younger you are, the quicker they wear out. We wish it were the other way around. But these valves, in general, will last perhaps about 10 years, um, and then would need to be replaced. And that might mean more surgery, uh, but there are also some new techniques being developed that might allow us to put a new valve inside this using a catheter passed up through the leg. So wouldn't necessarily have to have an open heart operation again. So those are the two choices. Both of them work well, but we still think the best option is to keep your own valve, if it's possible.